Cool. It's gonna be a little bit of a different stream. Mainly because it's gonna be a lot more chill than it is anything else. Because we've already done with the game. It's just be more of just chill to relax whilst I aim to try and go through everything. So there'll be a lot of like kind of I'm starting and stopping from me trying to find bits around the world for grime. So it's just a case of me yeah, finding bits. So there might be a case where people can get involved with saying where I need to go or what I need and stuff, but I've got like a little map kind of thing where I'm doing so I'm kinda of going through all the different areas in kind of order. I'll get through as much as I can on stream before the end. I'm not aiming to literally stream until it's 100% but I'll stream what I can and it's just going to be casual so um, yeah just chill and relax as I go through all this so. okay. the first area that we'll go through is the weeping try and get over here to be fair do need to go for that and will we properly start? I'll make a flask. Give me a cover. Yeah, it's the second time I've gone through this game. I don't need I didn't need to do what I need to do last time. When I was on doing this run the first time. On PC I did the um kind of main ending first. Um it's obviously you defeat um, Dindra and become like the head. Um, but the second ending is obviously if you basically uh, submit to him and you lose the head, obviously, your own head. <laughs> but that's the second ending, but you can do that ending first. So you can keep progressing rather than be locked out of it and have to do a second playthrough. So that's what I've done. I think I had a little bit of a bug anyway where I got the trophy for it anyway, which was very weird. But um, I still did it regardless just in case. But yeah, we'll just keep going and see how things go. Need to get up there somehow. How the hell do I get up there? Uh no, there is a path that drops down for it. See, there's a Morlax there, and the Moor Sword is there. Do I have both of them actually? These are my weapons, I do not have a lot. But the Morlax. Yeah, I do have that. Just a more sword I do not have. There's no other weapons in this area. I've got the other web blocks uniform because that's what I'm wearing at the moment. Finger blade. Do I have the finger blade? No. And that's at the very beginning. Okay. We'll do that then. So that is... One of the thing is about here. So I need to go down and across where I just came. New. Yeah, okay. And there's the finger blade. So the next area is to go to here. I need to figure out how to do this.
Oh, I want to grab that, thank you. How do you do this? That requires a blow trait. I've forgotten how. Interesting one. I need to figure out how to get that. Um, so we can skip that one for now. So I know that I can come back to that. Apparently, there's something over here. Get rid of you. We go up there. Up and around. Yeah, it has to get up there. What's our eye? Oh, hello. Okay, that's that gone. So next up is in the second area. Ah yes, I'm missing prey. So this is probably what I've missed a lot of. Okay, so I might be able to get a hold of that slow ability. I thought I had to do a bunch of other stuff. We go up. No. I'll grab that. More debris. So from here, and go this way. This leads to out here, but I don't need this. It is the other side. There's two of them. There's something. I got that. It's fine. Going over here. There's also something here. It's two different preys. Also, I can aim to get some of this uh, missing gear, which I think I already have. To be fair, do I have the prickly stuff? got the legs and chest but I haven't got the arms. That's not too bad to try and get hold of to be fair according to this. Yeah, that's not too bad. Cool, okay. So there is something here but I think I already got it. That's fine. This goes up to, yeah, okay, that's for that. Well, that's the wrong move. There we go.
five nails. So it should be and around here. Don't need to go down because that goes out. But I can complete the map actually. Got a lot more damage than I thought. Here. So from here, it's up and around, and then drop down. Seems fine. Yes. I think the weirdest area, tricky one, will be going through. Um, You're standing up. What are we going through the? No, oh, it shouldn't be actually. That's that. So everything now sorted for the clothing. Looking at this area is done. So I must have this. Yes. Okay. This is just a brick area, which is, mm, yeah, debris field, okay. Then that heads over up. Cool, okay. Oh, there's the um, friendly imposter that I need to try and get hold of as well. Ooh. Plenty of stuff. Bellow mace. There's a lot of stuff that I've missed in this first area. Okay. That's fine, though. That's what we're here for. We're here to do this. It goes across. It's actually um, nice going through this first time. It's actually quite nostalgic because I remember going through this area in the beta. Or the demo. And wonderful barking. Um, where do I need to go? I can take actually this shortcut down here. Because I don't need to go around. If I go up, a weapon is the bellow mace. Let's see if I have that. Because if I do, then I don't need to worry about it. Nope. Cool. Okay. So I'm going to grab it. I've missed quite a lot of that top area anyway. Yeah. I've missed a lot of it. Okay. Damn. All of this is new. So it comes across up there, drops down, 
Grab some odds and... Okay, Gleamish. So that goes across there, that's that piece. So it's in and up. I'm guessing that this is where I was supposed to get the uh, second weapon. Never actually did uh, drop down. Grab this. That completes this section. Yeah, because then everything else is around it. There's only a shot that I'm missing, but I don't need to worry about that. Let's see if I can climb up. So I am missing something, which is up here. And this goes up there, so we don't need to worry about that. It's just this way, then up. Okay, so I'm there. There's nothing this way. Oh god. Huh. Okay. That wasn't a trait, was it? Because would a trait say that it would be identified? Maybe I can head up. Oh, there's a weapon at the top. What the hell? go around for that. So... Yeah, that's a... Got to go around. So would it be easier just to... Yeah, I'll just spawn back. Hey, Vina, How's it going? I'm currently like, just doing all the 100% stuff at the moment. So... I've spawned at the wrong one. You go with this one. Enjoy some luxurious tea. Starts the day off. But yeah, get chilled out. Not much will happen. I mean, I've, like I said, I've um, I've completed the game. So it's now just going through all the areas now, finding stuff. We've got like a little map with all the little bits everywhere. Because my brain wasn't like it was before. I've also got a lot to go through. I mean, all of this is new area to you. 
in old bed. You've not seen any of this, I don't think, so that'll be interesting for you to see me go through. So I'm going to need to go back here. There's a lot of places I've not been to. And I'm going to, I mean, we've explored the vast majority of it. It's just, I think, there's a one or two little bits that I need, just need to try and get hold of. So. And that one's going to be a pain, because I need to get a trait that I have no idea what it is. I know it's a slow trait, it's just getting hold of it. So we can just head up this way. If you ever want to see me do a DLC boss, just let me know, because I've got a... There's a thing that I unlocked, which um, allows for um, replayability of boss fights. So I can even do your favourite boss, if you ever wanted to. Hell am I going up here? Let's grab this, that's living flesh. Okay, yeah, this thing goes... Huh? Deals with you, that deals with you. You got there. He just... It's a pick... Yeah, it does pick up. <laughs> Dog barking. Hey. Ugh. Let's just restart this. Before I end up dying. people up there which I not see. Cool. That deals with you. So now we can go down. Brilliance of no fall damage. Well hello. It's just a random room. Yeah, it's just a random room. Huh, okay. No worries with that. If 
So I've got two Crimson Nikers and then I've got the... that stuff. Jesus. Okay, so that's then done. So this area is then complete, excluding... the Mole Sword, which I can't get because of the slow walk trait ability so I do not have that so then the rest is in the desert thing is what do I and do not have this area is absolutely massive bow axes and the claw I'm pretty sure I have that Oh, I'm also going to need to find those blue things. Okay. Let's have a little gander, shall we? Gonna need to find all the hunters, the um, hunter points. So, let's go for the first one, which is over this way. And yes, Rina, your game is still beautiful. I did see a tweet, so it'd be quite nice to see you back to doing some small commissions. That'd be quite nice to see. I hope Dorian is doing well, by the way. Maybe he's not too, uh... Be fussy at the moment or causing too much of a hassle. Sue's so in a good mood today. Ah, that's very good. I must say that the um, these listeners are definitely new, but I hope you can sleep better again tonight. It's always good to get some more sleep when you can. Stay chill. Didn't even pay attention to you know what killed me then. Probably one of the uh, blobs. Keeps changing some not too <laughs> Nah, come on. You'll be fine. We'll be able to sleep properly soon. Like, consistent. I know that pretty much at the moment we're going through this well, we, you are, going through the stage of just um It's almost like your sleep pattern depends on what Dorian's mood is in. I mean, for me, it's just whenever my body decides to wake up. Uh. Yeah, if you want me to see, if you want to um, see any of the DLC boss fights, just let me know. Because. I'll show you a little quickly. I don't know how much you know about this. I've got the Prey Gauntlet. Which is a new thing that's been added into this. Basically it allows me to do any of the previous boss sites. Um, including the final performance. Which obviously you know I had a very rough time with when I did this for your game last year. 
um, do pretty much anyone. Where is, where is it? Surrogate Vulture, that is the hardest one for me. Um, then we got your favourite boss, Shapely Fidus, Fidus, however you pronounce it. That's just, that's still fun bosses though, to be fair. But yeah, I think Surrogate Vulture is definitely like, it's up there, so I can't say much of uh, what I know that I'm, you've told me because I don't want to spoil it anyone but still haven't seen any of the DLC bosses I think what I'll do is since we're here I'll treat you to two of them so we've got the giant of eyes I think that's one and the saga vulture that's definitely one Yeah, I think that's the two boss fights. I'll show you what these two are. We'll do the, this first one. I don't know how much I could actually dodge with this guy. There we go.
<laughs> it was fast, to be fair. Like, um, there is a new ability that um, I do have. Um, wonder if I've got that actually still. Where is it? Grow. There's a certain a tr uh, new trait that I have. Which one is it? Uh, they drop a kind of breath. Backs of enemies is that. Should use that. Maximum increases power duration. Yeah, this one here. Increases damage done by food. I, this could be an old one, but I just never used it. Okay. Um, lovely. So they do 30%? Two. I know that I can um, actually get a few more, so I might do that. Could you use them actually now? Okay, seven. Watch vision never pauses whilst the birth consumption heal is active. Now I've got quite a few points for doing this. Green explosion move restores fifteen percent of total force. Mm -hmm. Seems useful. So we'll do whilst Vina is in phone call. Never understood this. Oh, okay. Was I not allowed to touch them?
Okay. So then it's you. No idea what's even up here. Screw that up. Okay. So that was that. Ooh, you're the parkour little bit. There's one right underneath it, apparently. Yeah, there we go. You a boss fight. Which is... Fine. Again, there's another slow walking little bit here. I only just got that. Need air dash and hover double jump to get this next little bit. Which is this rock, which is fine. So then there's something underneath me actually. That's in this mouth, I already have it. Which is fine. And there's a prey down here. It's the eye boot. I already have. Yeah, missed. The next area would be... what else do I need? There's a lot of boulder plate stuff. That's you underneath it. Ooh, hello. Let's have a look at you. I'm gonna look at getting my stamina up. Where's the stamina? Use your maximum force by 20%. What's the regeneration? Where's that? There we go. So then it's 
down. Yeah. Because then it heads to here. Let's double check I've got all the boulder stuff before I boulder plate. Boulder plate. Yeah, okay, I do have all of it. So. Fossil fist. A weapon, which is that one. Yep, yeah, got that, that's fine. I don't actually think there's much else then. No. Because I got that weird crystal thing. So I think the next area will be next. Which is lithic. This area is massive. Well, next we are going to do the next boss. The next DLC boss for you. So far we've gone through two areas and grabbed a lot of other stuff. I'm kind of working my way through but I feel like I'm missing something. Which is slightly confusing me. The ability to walk slowly, which I do not have. Yeah, I don't even have it. Okay, enough. Let's do that. So, we're going to do the second boss. And then afterwards, we'll do your favourite one. I don't know. <laughs> this one caused me the biggest trouble, so I will probably die from this a few times. I'll give it a, give it, I'll give it a few times.
Lovely. <laughs> that took me an hour, I think, when I first went through it. I love that boss. It is very good. But then again, it is like a lot of it is not easy because I've like buffed up so much. Um, which I loved it. at the time. It was really, really difficult. Miss that one. I don't think I'm supposed to fall through the world, but... <laughs> I don't think... Just this Teddy was looking... I didn't... That was weird. It came up with like 100% for then. Some weird percentage. That was part of the gauntlet, though. That wasn't part of the actual thing. So it could be just a weird gauntlet. But hey, at least you know that. <laughs> Hope Theo's doing well. Uh, right, where was I with this? So, I need to go to Lithic. Um, I need to look at doing all the other bits now with this. It's gonna be a weird one. I need to. Because I need to find a trait. I have no idea where this trait is, though. Because of, um... I just don't know where to get the walk, the slow walking one. It says it's in... The wiki says it's in weeping. 
Okay, my butts. Yeah. Like I said, the, um, what was it? Surrogate Vulture? Yeah, that's Chef's Kiss, that one. I like that. Uh, lithic. Where am I going? Yeah, I am going lithic. Look at the lithic upper. We get the um, Soulgate Vulture and Shidra. They gave me the b biggest um, issue, I think. But I love the new area. The DLC area is very good. In fact, is there actually anything I need to do in the DLC area? Because then I can kind of show that off. Because this area, it's massive. Like, really massive. Enveloping petals. Let's go there. Petals. Welcome to the DLC area. Where I am missing quite a bit of the world. That does that. Friend. Great. Yes, I'm knowing you're in pain, mate. Need to find the lithic portrait still. find the lithic portrait. Where the hell is that? We'll come back to that later. I want to see if I can try and find a few other bits. So, go up there. How does that go? Okay, so let's... Ooh. Nope, wrong way. We have bigger teeth here now, apparently. Okay, that heads to there. Do not need you. Sneak up this way. It's because the DLC area has like twenty different um entrances to go in. I like the play on words the fact that it's called childbed though. I do. It's a nice, nice name for it. 
But this then goes towards the nerve roots, but we are not needing to go here just yet. We won't do all the stuff that's in here. down here past this area and got all of that to do okay now how do you get there you need to go up this. There we go. I need to actually just do it properly. Oh, that got close. Oh, I didn't use the thing. Ugh. There we go. Blooming hands. The blooming legs are underneath me. We already have, I think. And then it's the blooming chest. So now do I have all of it? Yeah, I've now got all of it. Which is... Lovely. There's one that I'm intrigued. Okay. I mean, the world book is... Ancient Man Skewer. So many abilities. Goes across here, that's fine, that's not dealt with. That's all good. A lot of it is now just trying to figure out how to get to certain places. Because I need to go here. No, I don't. Got the spine saw for that. So then it's going down. Where the hell is that? A lot of this is in traveler hands. Oh! <laughs> Why is the child bed so confusing? There's so many, like, kind of one-way paths and everything all over the place, according to this map. But this area is beautiful. I'll see if I can try and get to the, um, bottom for you, Vina. Uh, what 
walk to the other side of the charm bed. Dream fog. I had a cake kick somewhere. I don't know where I put them. Do mind the uh, weird ASMR on the left ear. It's just a So I do need to go left. Let's do that. Okay. Yes, it's down here. Oh, I remember what I need to do right now. Need a hover came in. Keep forgetting all that. No. What's that? Oh, cool. Get you up. Okay, don't think I was supposed to do that, but I'll take it. Another weird little glitch. Deals with you. Just get you out of the way. Take your breath. So then you. This area is pretty good now. I just need to head upwards. That completes that little circular bit. This is either done by going down. Yeah, that's by going downwards. So this was the area of the boss. And we just did it with the surrogate vulture. Which was a great laugh. Upwards. Grab the clutching roots. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where are you? There you are. Stop it.
Okay, that gets rid of them, so that's that. And then the... The weapon above me? Okay. Very delayed. How does one get up there? Get one to this. It's down there. How do you get up there? Because on the map, there's only a one-way entrance for it. Do need hover. Yeah, that's fine. Got that. Oh. Are you? Uh, there you are. There's something up there. There's a section up there. Don't mind me going this way. Oh, this just goes to here. So this is where you get your item. But we want to head down. Because we wanna, I wanna show you the uh, rest of the world. Not that way, I got a bit close. Okay, freedom there. So then that drops to there, that gets there, that gets there. Centipede whip now you already have. I fixed most of the map, I think, from the update that happens, because most of it was all uncovered again. Yeah. I don't do that. Ooh. That was me here anyway. I'd know. 
This goes... I've lost myself now, where the hell am I? I'm down here. Here now. That's that section there. Which is out there. Bunch of thoughts. Okay. Takes me up there. Why does that look like there's something up here? No, it's not. Okay. Close to the fun section now. This is the child bed. There is an NPC here that you talk to. It goes to this weird scene where it looks like a baby version of you is speaking. Or like the massive statues that were inside. that that's fine I need to make the ascent so that's the assistant but we need to go down. Because the interesting part is, is that has the trophies been updated to account the DLC stuff? I don't want to jump. So when gaining all the... Uh, that's this so I do have that there's a thought down here that I've missed I'll grab that why not Have you looked into much of Forspoken? That's what we'll be playing next. It looks a beautiful game. Made by Square Enix made it. And there's the memory. What is Shem? Okay. Pearl plate? Have I got pearl plate? Am I wearing pearl plate? No, I'm wearing petal stone.
Yeah, I've only got the chest. Apparently the hands and legs are right above it. And I missed it. Underneath me. Oh, it's this section. Right, okay. Yeah, okay. Makes sense now. Let's put you on just for a little bit of a boost just missed it right go down that's There we go. Grabs the plates and through here. What's that? That's all of that sorted now. Need to figure out how to get up there now. That is through you. going down this way. Then you are... Locked off wall. So that's up the top. Oh, that's up there. That just drops down to there, that... Okay, that's just for a rock. But I do need that one that's down here. So I do need to levitate a bit downwards. That's where the thing is. Yep. 
Hey, there we go. That brings down, so now it's some... God. Ugh. just wasn't running quick enough. Ooh, that's painful. Okay. Do I need to have all the Crimson Icas? I don't remember. We can do. We'll head to Lithic, so then we can complete some of that. So let's complete some of you, because you will have that last tablet that I need. As well as that, we need to um, go to the merchant at the World Pillar. I think he's here. Yeah, okay. There's a lot of stuff we need to buy from this guy. Just four. Pretty sure I have. Oh no, I don't. I used it all when I leveled up. Okay. I forget to treat yourself to a KFC Vina. Don't forget that. You deserve it. Increased mass gain. That might be quite good. Hmm. Two, three. I'm not going to have enough to buy it all, though. No, I'm not. Nerve root. Do we need anything in the nerve root? From that far up? I mean, there is a lot of stuff. Because where am I with that? Because that's that section there. So if I go up and then down, it gives me that. And also a set of armor. Mm -hmm. Let's do this quickly then. Gives me the breast shot from there, but I need to go up more. I might already have it actually. Shaper. Let me check. Do I have Shaper? No. You're to go up.
go up there. Oh, I might need to go round. Ah. So yeah, I'll get it this way then. Didn't necessarily want to drop down. Okay. Need to remember how to do this. Now I need to go down. There we go. Two of them now. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Did it just vanish? Oh, no, no, they are. So then that drops down to there. So I need to grab. We'll grab this though because it's only just a pearl, but. Seems to be something underneath me. There we go. The weak bone. What do you offer? Okay, you're part of resonance. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. I feel like I'm now just going to hover my way down to the very bottom. Oh no. Ah, I missed it. Okay, so I'm back to kind of where I was before. Now I can head up and around. Failed that. Come on, game. I know you're having a little bit of a weird issue at the moment. Yeah.
There we go. I like how so far off track I've gone because I just want to get some of these items. I wanted to go in order. Yeah, to be fair, I wanted to show off the uh, DLC area, so. At first I thought it was just going to be like its own kind of separate world. But it's nice it's integrated in. That is good. Just make that jump myself. Paper. What I wanted. <laughs> There's no way, Zena. The baby sleep. Um, right, I need to figure out where to go. So, back to Lithic because this area is just ridiculous. Because I got all of that to explore. Okay. So, let's head back to the warp. Okay. So from here, go down beneath me, and there will be the lithic portrait. Interesting because the map says I can go down underneath here. Although the world has changed. Is it portrait? Okay, that gets that sorted. Apparently, there's some guy to speak to. Just down here.
Is that will go Where is he? Not go there. Okay, so he's actually underneath me still. Oh, it's this guy. Yeah, what he's. Yeah, I've been to him before. Um, so a lot of it's just making sure that I've got everything else here. It's strange how I can't properly check if I have everything. Shifting barrier. Ravenous rock. Have any? I've used all them up. Portrait. Still need one of them. I think I know where that one is. Oh, hello, is in the massive area here. Hmm. That's from that. Okay, so I've already got it. Um. Island chest is fine. Fiddlestone. I have a lot of that already. Interesting. Something over here. Let's have a little gander. Because that would be going. I could have gone to that, to be fair. Can I still go? I think I can. Yeah. Yeah, down and across. So past this room. It's this little room. in there. No, it's not. Okay. That's a little light. Tiny room to unlock. He's just going to be there. Um, that drops down into there. That goes... Ross. Pointed traveller stuff. 
That'll be the next thing to try and get. Which is all up here. That's fine. Yeah. Okay. If I can go back to the top, just for a quick call. Okay. side. Okay. New. I'm sure I don't need to be up here, but... That sorts that out. So, where is that? Let's go under... That then goes up to the top, which is over here. So now I need the hover to be able to go... Over here. Twelve percent less damage. Ooh, okay, and that's health and strength. What am I doing at the moment? Health and strength. Okay, basically the same as what I have. So I got fifteen percent bonus health. Seven point five and seven point five. Five. We'll see. That's the droplet. That's fine. So the rest of it now is actually underneath me. Missed it. Okay. Those are that. So that's the lithic stuff now got. Cool. Now it's just the other side. Get all that. Wow. 
wonder if I can just do the same thing that I did here. Just just hover. I might be able to. Give it a try. What's that? Okay, platform start. And that's the breath you drop there. Okay. And then... Another one of you. Stop it. This is just a little open arena here, yeah, okay. While this door looks like Okay. So I got that. It's now just traveling downwards. That's for the chest, which is perfect, and then further down is then the hands. Lovely. Oh. Then. Got a massive chunk area, but we don't need to visit it. So, we are pretty good now. That's good. I'm going to see if I can find this little guy. Apparently, he's right here. Get rid of that. Because I might already have him. No, I don't. There we go. Okay, now I have three. Don't know how many there are in this world then. Must be another three to go. But I mean, pick this up. Ah, oh, this is a little screen that I have happily avoided. Yeah, because then that drops down to it. Okay. So then that's most of most of Apolithic then covered. Because a lot of it then is just armor pieces but I already have so let's move on to the next area which is the nerve root which is massive big top area is done 
It's then now trying to figure out how to get all the lower end stuff sorted. I'm missing quite a bit. Because all of that is sorted. Then from here, it's missing. Get rid of you, don't need you anymore. Could probably then just travel back to the world pillar from that then. So we'll do that. Okie dokie. There's an area that I missed that goes up. A fragment. Bone grinder. Okay. Pretty happy with that. Now it's just heading out that way. I forgot if the thing spawn. I don't think they do because it's not attacking me. That doesn't work. So what's underneath me there then? There's a pillar fragment. I don't need to worry about. Okay. Is it here? No, further down. The war blade. So what else is needed from it? I think it's then just... No, nah, because it's... chunk. We'll probably level up about six different weapons max here. Yeah, that stuff I definitely cannot touch. So then, further down, Marvin Greatsword. Because I've just come from there, I am now 
Aqui. Yeah, so right underneath me here is a space. Down here. Carving great sword. Now we're making loads of progress. Grab this for some minute. So what else is needed? That is a massive area right here. Links the two together. I don't need that. It's the nerve root is gold head okay and it's going through all this area I have most of this Food listeners here. And let's go see them. I'll drop down here. See, yeah, okay, I need to go this way. Got away with a little bit of full damage there. What I will do is actually quickly right for now, welcome back. And do something quickly. Game has hit a bit of a weird stutter, I don't know, it's because basically I'm playing this straight away from last time, so a quick refresh. But welcome back, hopefully doing is not sleeping. I've moved too fast for the game, it didn't even load up the menu properly. Where the hell am I? Okay, nope, 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 nope. That little room does that. Okay, already seen him then.
He also made that. I am pretty far. Um, so... Ninety percent missing five trophies. I need to find all the hunt points, so I do need to find that. Get all the outfits, all the weapons, and all the um beetle pearls. So I'm getting, I am close. It's the section of just going around and finding everything. Is a lot of it would be down to all the hunter points is finding the ones that are enemies that I've missed. Did it say that I needed all the weapons? Yeah, it did. So that's going to be a stump. I have no idea how to get the crawling ability in this new one. Or the slow walk. It says I need to go towards the weeping, but I'm missing it. And one way to find out if I've got everything is by going up here. So I'll do that. We're getting close. We are getting close. But I'll stream as much as I feel comfortable with doing it. Might quickly go downstairs and get my traffic cakes though. Have something to eat, so... What we'll do is I'll quickly spawn at the nerve root. Okay. I'm quickly just going to grab some food. I'll be back in about a minute or so. And is back. So it feels like I've got like half a flask still. I get worried when I'm doing this top because there's been one or two times when I've done it and I've undone it a little bit too much and just falls out and I end up spilling tea everywhere. So, it's 5,000 there, a few hundred there. But the lithic portrait, I still need to give that to someone. I 
don't have enough chunks. But we're looking good. I feel like we're making we are pretty good where we are, to be fair. Um right, so the next part is going up. Yeah, it's through here. This area is completely blocked off. It's underneath me. It gets down to there. But there's nothing there anyway that requires me to be there. I do need to go up. It's pretty much just further on ahead. Where do you go? Stupid. Where do you vanish to? Oh, you go up. I missed it. It's probably despawned now. Okay, on. Add it first. <laughs> okay, so you haven't despawned, that's good. Hesitated. Jumped into it. Stupid. Got two of these. Was it going to make that? <laughs> Stupid. My timing's all off. All off. Okay. So there's another two more to go. Oh god, okay. So that goes to there. I feel like there's like so much there's so much here. Okay. I'm there. that. Eyes came in, use him. Nothing 
Hä? Is there something that goes down there then? No. So this is for this area. Just just underneath, that's for the motley pole. Need to worry about that. So I've got the root walker there, it's just the craver that's above here then. Which I have not killed. Yeah, give me that. Hmm. Really enough is a lot of this area is I thought I've already been to but I think I struggled a lot here. Okay, that's another weapon. Thank you, internet. So the dash is then to grab this. Then once that's done, this area is actually now sorted, I think. I think I've got everything. It looks convoluted, but it's actually not. Hollow root. Let me just make sure that I've got the hollow root stuff. got the chest. Okay, where's the chest? That's the top. Okay, I need to travel up. I need to go upwards. I need to go upwards, Vina. Got quite a bit of the um, monies, but I need it to buy a lot of the stuff that's at the Stitcher's Merchant, he's got a lot of the stuff that I need. So I just need to head up. Just missed it. Okay. Fart. 
do it's above me it's right there I go round maybe just missed that oh what hang on a minute what are you ah there it is Ooh, double kill satisfying okay again there's something let's double check I haven't killed this thing over here then I think I have. Because over here should be an enemy which he's no longer here, which is good. Okay. So I can get rid of you. I think I feel pretty happy with how this is all going. Missing pieces seem to be just gems. That's fine. Where do you want me to go next game? The world builder. This area. Ah, okay. There's a lot of area that I've missed. This will be fun. Onto the wall pillar. It's a massive chunky area. Have you ever had Jaffa cakes, Rina? I must say. They could have easily filled up more of that package. So, describe what they are. Imagine like a very thin cake, like a sponge. Wait. It's hard to kind of see it, to be fair. It's like a thin layer of crust, and in the middle, it's just basically like an orange jelly. Hmm. Not a fan of the orange chocolate combo. Okay. Is it just the, I guess it is, in a sense, the whole um, mixture. Puts me into here. There's a fragment at the top. Is there any like type of um, combination of chocolate that you like with like a certain, I guess, fruit? I 
like flavored chocolates or do you just prefer chocolate as it is Okay, yeah. Is it? Have you ever had a chocolate fountain then? Oh, my lord. How I made that, I think. Chocolate fountains are hilarious, but they are actually a little bit dangerous as well. Oh my god. But what it is, is, um... It, it's a fountain. Um, but it's basically just got a load of, like, hot chocolate, but the heating element, um, and gets, like, dangerously hot. Obviously it needs to be extremely hot for it to melt chocolate. Enough for it to basically be... Enough to almost flow like water. So... You then have, if you leave it on too long, or the um, the brand of fountain that you got is like quite cheap because you only wanted it kind of like a one-off. A one-off ones are like totally fine. You know, you use it until the basic the elements burnt out, and then you just get rid of it. Um, but if you want to use it constantly, then it will just you end up causing a fire. Like, it will start smoking. <clears throat> so, I am here. Uh. Get some much Yeah, no worries. Take your time. I am going to be here. Um, I'm gonna need that hunt point. Okay. That will go into here. Ah, perfect. Up into here. Nice. Okay, whilst we're here, we can go back to the merchant.
Okay, that's all the weapons and everything we bought off him. That's pretty good. I don't think there's actually quite a lot here. I've got the sword. Yeah, okay. Now back to the gloom nest. Yeah, okay. We'll go back to the gloom nest then. Gonna bake more cookies later. Gonna make them crispy or soft. We're gonna try and find that equal, like that point where it's like crisp shell and really soft inside. Is that? What Yes, ah, oh. ah. Oh. <laughs> it would be literally in case of just have a moist, some moist cookie. Okay, so now into this area. Need pull item for this, which is good. So let's quickly double check everything here. We have drained base slasher. Okay, so is it just in terms of Oh, there's a one of those special blue crystal things. It's two of them. Two of them. I think I've got one of them actually. I don't know I don't know if I've got two. So we definitely have Drained the burst lantern. Let's quickly check that. So, drained stuff. We have all the drained stuff, so we got all the armor here, so that's very good. It's now just a case of double checking I've got all the weapons that are from this area. Because if it is then it's just a case of going to the hunted points to make sure that I've killed everything properly. So it's the burst lantern. Which we have, very nice. And the face slasher which looks like a weird scythe thing which we do have. Lovely jubbly. Bow daggers. I never understood Goldhead. He was always quite philosophical whenever you spoke to him. I th you honestly th felt like he was going to be one of those that's like, oh, here's a. You piss him off enough and he'll be a boss fighter. So I need to double check here. Because it's a Crimson Icon here as well. Who's whimpering? Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, there it is. Thank you. First. Find all hunt points. I honestly thought that was going to be the worst of them to do, but... Ok, 
Okay. So then now it's just making sure that I've got everything else. Oh, okay. Right. So let's head downwards. Go on, hit me again. Okay. So this next section... Not by doing that. Okay, that's just that, so there's something underneath it. Ah, there we go. Ooh. Back in there. So, underneath me... That, so let's just double check. I've killed this thing that's down here. Looks like I have. And then the skewer, which is already dead because that was from him. So I think this area is actually pretty good. Which is pretty satisfying. Because all the hunter points are now done, so it's literally just weapons and armor. So to Yuridan, which will be next. Which is actually above me. Nope. A bit further up. Oh, shit. Right, you're in. Here we go. Yudin has the first year... First years. Outfit. First year chest. Legs and hands, we've got them. Uh, is there anything else? The broken Euro sword. Is there any other weapons here? The year glaive and sword. And the curved glaive. So broken year sword. Curved glaive, okay, we got that. Got the year glaive, but we don't have the broken year sword. Hmm. Interesting how I don't have that because that's right at the entrance.
Yep, you still hit hard. Okay, so it's literally... Oh, it's hidden. Right there. Going the wrong way. You can hear you purring away. I'm not going to fight you both, though. I don't understand how he just missed me then. Broken your sword. So let's source that out. Get rid of you. Making very good progress, actually. I'm enjoying this. Ah, uh, now it's the Feaster's Lair. We're really close to a war point, so we'll just go up here. I'm not going to level up because I know that I still need to buy stuff. Beast's Lair, so let's start from the very f beginning of it and we'll work our way across. So, Sunken Bones. There's a massive path underneath it that I've not actually got. Yeah, that one. Which actually is linked to that. Okay. So let's have a quick little gander. So there's a listener that is just ahead of me. Thank you for spawning me here. Sounds like he's clapping. So the listener's already dead. Yeah, that's it. It should be here. Okay. So let's have a little quick browse on what we have to deal with. We've got the Law Axe. No, jaw axe. It screwed me over a little bit. <clears throat> okay, lucky enough it is in alphabetical order. I don't have it. Okay, so we'll grab that now. It requires me to go here yeah. I just realized that if I when I get this 
This will be the second time. I've got 100%. There it is. Chorax. So that's sorted. We can now go teleport. Because we now need to go to the Mauler's um, teleporter. Surrogate. Double check we have all of this stuff. So let's quickly... Oh, no, don't want to do that. Use you. Let me go to the Maulers now. Which is... Maulers. Is it Maulers or Maulers? No, Maulers. So, check if we got the jaw plate. Do you have the jaw plate? No, we have none of it. Ooh, massive hunt here. So it's right underneath me. And it's right here. How many you? So then... That's the jaw plate stuff. What is that? Ah, okay, I didn't need to worry about it. I did shit. Come here. Thank you. Take the damage that I need to. I'm happy with that. So then the next one. Is going through the. Shortcut. Where we head outwards and then through here. Door plate chest. Cool, got it. We have our distance for the other two. That's pretty good. So now let's just double check we've got all the other items. So a lot of it now will be just weapons. So we've got the tooth hammer. Tooth fist but not tooth hammer. Okay, that's fine. We can go and grab that now. This is a very convoluted way of getting to it. Uh, no, actually it's not. Yes, it is. No, it's not. <laughs> we just need to go back to the Maulers. So from here, we head downwards. Go as uh, Goes with you. Oh, 
we had across from it. And speak to the owl whilst we're here. And then from here down. And that's the tooth hammer. Progress. Speak to this funny fella. <clears throat> so you got two of them for me. I might actually buy them. Why buy one of them? Okay, the hour is done. So the next part would be Pizza Glaive. Do I have the pincer clip? Yes, I do. <clears throat> so pincer clip is now done, which means that everything is sorted. the pieces left, I just still need to go back to the sunken bones because I now need to get this other weapon. Tooth fist. Wait, I already have that. Yeah, I've already got it. So I don't need to do it. Oh. Okay. Now for the servant's path. Okay. Where's the closest way to start this? The servant's path. Okay. Is that curiosity, Vina? Like when you're making cookies, Dutch. Have you ever done any of them which has had a filling? Oh. Uh, seventh path. There's quite a lot of area I haven't even gone to. Double check this platform here. There he is.
Okay, you were a little bit more of a hassle than I thought you were going to be. Do I have the shapely greatsword? No, I do not. There's a weird cutout section here. So it's down through there. Sword sorted. So it's now just making sure that I've got everything else. Seventh needle, I'm pretty sure I have that. Seventh needle, yep. Got there. Got him. Weathered Stitcher Chest. I do not have any of it. Unless I'm wearing it. Nope. Yeah. I'm missing the entire set. So we head back. We head downwards. Don't have any items that I can burst. Let's quickly, uh, see what we can spend these on. Uh, grow... we have seven. I need to keep one for something though. Force regeneration, don't need to worry about that. Deal 25% more damage whilst below 20% health. Don't wish to be on that. Increases all damage done by 20% for three seconds after pulling an enemy. Already got that one. Healing done by breath is increased by. Yeah, I'll do that. And then. Hmm. To failing. Which was unsuccessful. You need to find that, but with health. I don't even necessarily worry about the increasing of idol. Parry duration. Now oh, there it is. Um, to be fair, it's good as it is on eight percent. Increase this. And I'll leave it for now for the rest. So then it's now just heading downwards. Not like that though. 
don't even need to go down there, but I'll do it just to complete the map. So it's literally now past this next area. Yeah, there's three pieces as well as in the apprentice, which is here. Okay. Where the hell did you come from? Whoa, okay. Let's do you one by one then. Oh, that got a little bit close for comfort. Okay, so here... Where am I? Okay, I'm under there, so... Could head down? See if I got this. Okay, so I do have this already done. So I found him. Then, right now, this is where we were. As you are here. Right, that's the withered legs. Oh, there's another one there. More living flesh. So under here is the hands and chest. There's the hands. There's the chest. I shall leave you to be because I don't need to fight you. Okay. Lender and Stitcher apparently here actually, so I might quickly do this. They might be gone because of progression of story. So next up. Is doing this next bit. is just up here. Come on down.
Okay. Lightly annoying. <laughs> Get trapped in that. So it's under here. There we go. Oh, this requires the slow walk trait. Okay. I need to see where the slow walk trait is. Where do I find it? Where are you? Slow walk trait. It says it's from the crawler, but I don't know how to get to it. Absorbing all skills. I want the left thumbstick to walk slowly, but where is it? Hmm. I might need your hand with this, Vina. But this next bit seems that the final piece I'm missing from here is the ability to slowly walk, but I do not have it. Because I don't have the trait. It comes from the crawlers and the weeping... Oh, unless I'm being really stupid. Uh, for the meantime, we'll come back here later. I'm going to be stupid for a little bit and take off my glasses because it's to my head. Okay, I can deal with this for a little bit. I don't want to take my glasses for too long. So that part is done, for now, uh, now we've got to do the Carmen Palace, okay. Let's go to the entrance. Freaking. So, I'm here. Apparently, there's a massive void missing. Thank you. There's random weird blocks all over the place missing. So, let's double check what we have to deal with. So we have the celebration stuff and the formal formal coda. So let's check we got the formal coda stuff first, because we can explore everything south first. Crying sickles. There's 
which one? That's the bottom one. Which we don't have. I remember using that weapon quite a bit. I think that's what the, my main weapon was when I first started. Okay. Hmm. Just head downwards. Celebration, let's have a look at that quick. Celebration, I've got everything for the celebration. Good. And the formal. only got the chest and I haven't got the other two that's fine Okay, so that drops me to there. Oh, that's actually perfect. So then it's straight ahead. Well, kind of. So from here, then it's down. I'm glad that the... Uh Levitating doesn't exhaust stamina. So it should be right here. That's one. And that's two. So have I now collected everything that's now south of the... Yeah, you got the prying sickles which comes from here. So I might actually quickly do that. So that comes from there, and then there's another item that comes from down here. We'll look into that later. We'll do it now, actually. Once we get that sorted, then we can worry about it. It's weirdly part of it, so uh, let's quickly go over to the flower. Is it the garden next? So from the garden... The hair strands. Okay. Easiest way to do it is from down beneath. So we need to do a bit of running parkouring. Because I think I'm. This is where the last. Um. Beetle petal is? 
Because it looks like it. This is another one. Which means there's another three that I'm missing. So from here... Right, got a bit close. There we go. Watching route. Ooh, okay. Route. I don't need to fight you, do I? No, but there's something above him. Ah, there we go. Gone downwards. There you are. Yeah. That's that found. Okay. So we now have all the feet of battles. Just At this rate, I will be staying on. So I complete this. The only issue is the um, missing That's the prime sickles. So that's from the previous area. So I've got that, which means that's the last of everything that's in the underground of the castle. Everything is now above. Over to the where's the best one to start off? Would it literally just be the elevator entrance? Yeah, let's just try the entrance. Then it's going up. And then it'll be the first one, would it? It's down, goes across. Starts from there, so I might have to go all the way to the top and then go around. We'll see, I need to find out if I've got the Adept first. 
Do I have the adept? Nope, because I've only got B. I get up there. Okay, you don't attack. I'm just going to leave you. Um, and now it's this little bit. Pretty sure I found a shortcut for this area. Just going up and around. Ah, right, okay. It's up there, okay. Is it? Should be down just straight up. Aha. There's the adept stuff. Keep going because there's a kind of semi boss fight here. Yeah, capture giant. He drops a ask, but oh, wow, okay. Okay. Drops that. I'm quite lucky with that drop then. So I got that. So then what is next? <laughs> so many chiseled nails. Do I have them? A crawler. Oh, I need to absorb one more. 
Right, okay. Now I know what I need to do with it. I'm an idiot. That's fine. So chiseled nails. Got that, that's perfect. Just gonna make sure they've got everything. Searing sickle? Yeah, I've got that. I'm going to the very top and make sure that I've got everything. Everything is looking very good. I think that's actually all of it, you know. Yeah, okay, so... I now know what I need to do. So we're going to go back to the very beginning and do this bit again, now that I know what I need to do. The depth should have it. These people, one of them I need to parry. Let's see that. That unlocks it. Whoa. There we are. Here we go. Now we can do this. More sword. That's everything done, I think, for this area now. I need to go back to... Where is it? Here. And go to the entrance again. Warp to the entrance. This will be 100%, wouldn't it? Can I even edit the tanks for this? I mean, yeah. See how much if I use hundred. Percent. Oh, maybe not then. I'll just leave it as it is. Okay. This will be a hundred percent stream. I didn't realize how easy I would be able to do this. Underestimate it myself. Uh, three and a half hours, it's not too bad.
I remember this area being that. Yeah. Okay. So there's quite a bit of this to do. Okay, so now that I'm here... Nope. Okay, there are platforms there. I could have moved, but I decided not to. <laughs> That's the husk root sorted. What's that offer? Okay. I mean, purple. I mean, how does that look if I was to just shove that on? It's a cosmetic. Why not? Grab this at the same time. That is everything. Okay. So then the next one is the garden. I feel like out of all of it, it might be the child bed that might be last. How am I doing with trophies? Outfits and weapons. Um, I'll go to the child bed first because I want to try and get that. Buy that item. He's been infected. Mm. Okay, so 
That's all done. Let's we'll keep on track. To how the map looks. So I can go to the bursting trees. Warp bursting trees. So first off, we've got the petal gem stuff. Petal pearl and petal gem chest, but not the legs and the hands. Okay. because apparently it's actually quite close to here. It's right there. Nice. I got all of the... Oh, this makes things very interesting then. Where's the last weapon? Weapons. Are there any weapons here? The motley swords, which I'm pretty sure I actually use. Yep, Mortley Swords, I do have them, so that is that done. Tell you what, Vina, we're on the path to glory, yeah. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Missing. Centipede Whip. Do I have the Centipede Whip? Centipede Whip, got that. Spine axe. And you've got spine sword. Okay. I need to get there, but how? So that's from the dream fog. So the rest of it, I think, is DLC weapons. go from the dream fog. There's a path that goes up. It's a random path. Can I take it? Possibly. Maybe that's how you get up there.
Not like that. Okay. This is all for one weapon, I think. It's me there, so Oh, I need to... Yeah, okay. Yeah, lovely park. Cool, this is. Oh. further each time. Keep on I'm press it as soon as I went into it. Okay. Okay, man, you got this. There we go. <laughs> I'm on the verge of needing a P as well. Need a pass. So dramatic. Done again. I think I need to remember when I get to that point, I don't need to like charge forward because I don't have much room to start the sprint. Okay, there's lots of it. 
And that goes all the way across the top. So once I get there, I think I should be fine. Little bag chest. There's actually a p an armor piece that I don't have. Yeah, there's armor that I don't actually have. That's interesting. Set of armor that I don't have, but it doesn't really, doesn't need to be required. So I wonder if the DLC stuff does not count then. But hang on a sec, this is going up there. This is interesting. I don't need to go up there. from here the way diagonal one and then straight across Give me that. Then it's heading down. Got it. Platinum trophy, 100%. And that's even with... I think that's even the DLC ones as well. Trophies. Yeah. That's even with that. Twice I've got it now. But I'm happy with that. That's good. That's that's actually quite a nice way to end off getting a um that trophy, getting that last weapon. That was a pain, but well to be fair it wasn't much of a pain because I took the route that I didn't need to, but I do see that there was the sickle back stuff, which I do not have. So, purely for my own entertainment, I'm going to grab it. Which does me having to do all of that. So, let's drop down here. Do this. Oh. And now we're just playing for the sake of just three random items that I don't actually need. But hey. I enjoy this game a lot, so I'm going to do it.
Okay. Let's do this again. But this time, we're going for the uh, bonus, I guess, armor set. Yeah, I felt like I messed that up a little bit. Dashed one too many times. And it threw me off. Sneaky. I need to build up my stamina again for that. Ah, I didn't... Okay. I let go of the, um... Sprint button. Too slow, too slow. Damn it. <laughs> Come on, got this. Keep on double tapping, I don't need double tap. As in like I'm dashing. But I'm not holding it down straight away, I'm having to doing it on the second press. I don't need to do a second press. Ooh.
Oh. Okay, so this item should be here. That's that. I'm there. I'm trying to figure out where I am now. Okay, this looks like just in case you fail. To go back to it. So what is this one? To go back to it. The would-be body of, the, of a spy one tossed down the world pillar in frustration. Okay. Let's grab the other two bits. So that is, the first one is through hovering. Which is that. Get rid of that. And the next one will be the next one down. Sickle pack legs. Okay, now I feel more comfortable with this now. It's to know of my own. Stolen breath. It's the gattered. Not me. Whoa, whoa. Okay. That is everything. Okay, so. Let's go back to the waypoint. Oh, we ended there. Four hours. That's actually not too bad, too. Um, that's really good. Four hours stream and get a platinum trophy for it. One of them, I. Do I have any... Plenty. Okay, Let's see what happens now. Uh, grow. Yeah! 69. Nice. What a perfect way to end the stream. Level 69 and a Platinum Trophy. Cool.
Well, I'm gonna leave it as that. Go back to this. Trophies. And there it is. We did it again. I don't think I did the stream of 100... The 100% when I did it on Steam, but... I got it on... PS5 now. Got it twice. So... Yeah. We'll end it there. And... We'll go for a raise. Because I want to eat and... Go to the toilet. So... We will see who we got. Maggie is streaming. So, yeah, why not? Let's read into Maggie. He's playing Astroneer and he is with uh, Ashley Crow. So, we'll go into Maggie's stream. So, thank you for watching everyone. Uh, regardless if it's stream or through YouTube. It's been a wonderful Platinum Trophy stream. And, yeah. Thank you, Vina. And thank you for everyone else involved in the development for this game. For me to get this thing again. So, it's twice now. So, yeah, thank you for creating a beautiful game. So, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to end, go back into the end scene, and we're going to raid into Maggie now, so thank you again for watching.